Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video may be a little bit random because I'm just about to head out to go into the city because today is the 14th of January and these dunks are meant to be dropping. So they are the Vast Grey and the Nike store in Melbourne Central and Emporium have been doing like random drops for these dunks. So they dropped the Coast Dunks yesterday as well as the Panda black and white colorway. And then the day before they dropped it as well and I missed all of them. But wait, let me show you. But <laughs> one of my Instagram followers kindly got a pair for me. Um, so these are the Coast Dunks and they dropped them at the Emporium store yesterday. Um, so yeah, I just have a feeling that the Vast Grace may drop later today. I just don't know what time it would drop. So the other day, I asked one of the staff there because I missed a drop and I was just like, oh, do you guys have anything left? And he told me that they had a drop at 2 p.m. and also at 5 p.m. So, well, <laughs> if it's dropping at 2, I'm definitely going to miss it because it's 1.43 now and I'm still here talking about these coast dunks. But yeah, one of my Instagram followers actually sold these to me. So thank you so much. I hope you're watching this video. I really, really appreciate it. And I'm so happy that I got these in hand because yeah, there's going to be so many dunks dropping this year. And if you did not pick up a pair last year, this is definitely the year to get onto the dunk wave and yeah like I said there's going to be so many different colorways and I feel like I want all of them but I think that's going to be a little bit tough because I've obviously already missed out on the black and white pair. Um, so this is obviously a UCLA inspired colorway and I really love how there's hints of like this yellow gold embroidery on the back of the heel as well as on the tag on the tongue and yeah I don't know whether I should wear this today like it would go really well with the jumper I'm wearing at the moment this is from Supreme and it's really old I'll try my best to find a link to link it down below for you guys because I do get asked um, most of the time when I wear this in my video and I usually try and link everything that I'm wearing. So if you guys are ever wondering, maybe just check the description bar below and most of the time I link stuff in there. Um, but yeah, I'm really happy with these Coast Dunks and also they release them in women's sizes. So you can see on the box here, it says W, so that's women's. So this is a women's 8, which is a men's 6.5. And with Dunks, I feel like they fit true to size, but I don't know. I just feel like I don't like my sneakers to be very snug because I'm usually like a men's US 6. I usually prefer going half a size up just to be on the safe side and maybe my socks are just very thick. I don't know. But if I got a men's US 6, that's fine as well. But this is a 6.5 and the retail price is 150 Australian dollars. And yeah, I mean, the vast gray dunks look super good and I really, really want them. I'm not too sure whether that is men's or women's sizing. I got a feeling it's in men's. So I'm hoping they make them like in smaller sizes. Like I hope the smallest is either like a men's seven or six. Cause if it's like a men's eight, it's going to be a little bit too big for me. But if I can cop, I'll probably still try it anyway. Um, but yeah, it's just not confirmed whether it's going to be dropping today. Uh, so I don't know. I could like go to the Nike store and nothing's gonna happen. But I thought it just can't hurt to try. So I might go there and ask them if they have any release details. Even though I don't think they'll tell me because every time they drop something, as soon as one person knows, like you just see a huge line um, of resellers lining up there and there's like nothing wrong with that. Um, you know, if you're a reseller, you do your thing. You do you. Um, but I just miss out on everything. <laughs> oh, they always tell me after the fact it has happened and I'm like, guys, I'm missing out on everything. Um, so yeah, I really want to get this pair and obviously I don't want to pay resale for them. I just want to pay the retail price. So I should really stop talking. I'm going to maybe show you guys what these look like on feet quickly. Okay. And then we can head out. Obviously you guys can see I'm just in my kitchen right now. I can't decide if I want to wear these out today because I haven't done the B-roll 
for the video where I show you guys like the detail shots and stuff and I don't know I like to do it when the sneakers are like fresh and unworn so that you can see like the outsoles and you don't see any creases um, but yeah maybe I'll just show you here all right maybe I'll just do my unprofessional b-roll that I've been doing for you guys but yeah you guys can see there is the sort of yellow gold detail here on the back of the sneaker as well and then the insole is also in that color even though no one is looking at your insoles but yeah it's such a nice colorway and for 140 dollars i mean you really can't go wrong i really really love the dunks because i feel like they're super versatile and let me <laughs> just put on my shoes right now they're so cute! Wait, <laughs> it's the first time I'm trying them on feet. I got them yesterday. I need to make this quick because I don't want to miss the drop if it does happen a bit later on at the Nike store. Okay, please ignore <laughs> if you see any like clutter at the back. But this is what the dunks look like on feet. They look so cute! Look at this. I love it. I mean, sorry for the bad lighting, but they look so good you definitely need a pair look at this and they work really well with just your standard like white nike socks and my outfit i don't really know what's like what is what is this look i don't even know but i'm wearing this like supreme top i just have some bike shorts that i bought like randomly online and my knees look so ashy so just ignore that but yeah today the temperature is 22 degrees so it's kind of nice it's not like super hot but i think it is kind of like cool so that's why i'm wearing like a long sleeve like jumper thing um but yeah i can't decide if i want to wear these out i don't think so maybe not but yeah let me give you guys another look just in case you want to see my very unprofessional b-roll <laughs> of the on feet anyway guys i should head out soon um maybe i should bring you guys along with me i don't know because i could bring you guys and then there could be nothing to see <laughs> i could just bring you and go to the nike store and then like nothing would release um so yeah i don't even know because i'm trying to decide if i do go into the city and there's nothing to cop then like what do i do because the stores close at 7 p.m and i don't want to be just waiting around till 7 p.m waiting for something to drop so i'm just so confused and i okay wow i'm so rambly already i think the plan is i'm gonna go to the nike store and then i'm gonna ask like the person that's working there if anything's going to be dropping today and hopefully they will tell me some info like if they tell me nothing's going to drop then that's cool and i'll just come home and then maybe i can do like a better review of the coast dunks um but if it is dropping then i can pick up a pair and then hopefully i can show you guys because i think the release has been delayed for you guys in the states so yeah hopefully you guys can have like an early look um and help you decide whether you want to pick up a pair but honestly like based on the photos you just need to pick them up you don't have to think about them you just need to pick them up and i think they won't be as difficult to get as last year because there's going to be so many different colorways dropping and from what i know like every store is getting them here or here in australia anyway like Foot Locker, jd sport all the nike stores um am i missing out on any main stores but yeah even like the really general release stores are getting them oh hype dc had them as well so yeah i'm sure you'll be able to cop a pair when the release does happen anyway <laughs> let's head out okay guys i changed my mind i think i'm gonna go with my kentucky dunks instead today so you guys can see it is a darker blue compared to these coast dunks wait can you guys see very very unprofessional b-roll right here um but yeah i feel like my shorts keeps like riding up but this is the look we are going for today and uh, I mean it's not much <laughs> of a difference compared to what I was wearing before essentially it's just a different colorway but look at them they look so cute together um, okay well 
I don't know why <laughs> I just keep on chatting with you guys. But okay, okay, for real, let's head out now. So you guys, massive fail. I went to the Nike store here in Melbourne Central and they said they, I feel like they thought I was asking about the red and grey dunks that released this morning, which is not what I was looking for. I want the vast grey dunks. Um, but yeah, they told me they don't have any information and it's kind of like a shock drop most of the time. So I feel like I shouldn't wait around for it, but I mean, at least I tried. And then while I was on the way to the Nike store here, I saw a bunch of kids like running like in the other direction and it kind of freaked me out because I thought maybe something was dropping at fast times because the street hawker dunks um, are meant to drop within the next few days so I thought that might be it and I actually walked to fast times but there was nothing um, so yeah I think I'm just gonna go get some groceries and then go home and then I'll give you guys like a better look at the coast dunks that I got yesterday so I'm in the supermarket and I'm in the snack aisle trying not to buy all the snacks because guys I just really love snacks and I want to show you this is one of my favorite shapes flavor so it's Vegemite and cheese I think this is super super good plus it's on special so I mean I don't know I feel like if I buy it I'm gonna eat the whole box look at all these biscuits on sale how can I not want to buy all of them and I really really love these I know they're so basic they're just like this wafer kind of biscuit but I really like them and they're only a dollar and we have like a few Oreo flavors now we never used to have that many variety my basket is actually looking pretty healthy right now because I'm planning on making a salad when I get home this is what my basket is currently looking like I don't think I've ever tried veggie jerky before but it looked kind of interesting so I thought I might try that but uh, I need to get a few more things and then we can go look at how cute this is so these are Aussie classics and I've never tried these either it says golden gay time crispy cream flavored I think I tried this on a vlog like ages ago and it was pretty good but it's full price so we're not gonna buy it <laughs> and then there's also like maxi bond on top there's like heaps of ice cream and I'm so tempted to buy some today I don't know <gasps> look at this so cute anyway okay I'm so distracted so this is usually my go-to with like ice creams I really like which one the cookies and cream is pretty good um, but maybe I should try salted caramel why is this not focusing I'm so sorry guys okay hopefully that is a little bit better so this is the first thing I see when I get home and this is my current sneaker rotation that I thought I'll share with you guys. I'm sure not much has changed since the last time because I generally have my Dior's here and some Jordan 1's. Um, I wore my Syracuse Dunks yesterday and I just have my slides and these are just the ultra boots that I wear to the gym. So these are always out here. My Magellas are here, my Sakai's because I love these so much. I have my Vandy Dunks as well as my undercover Daybreaks. I don't know if you guys can tell but these are so beat up. And then yeah, I have my Kentucky Dunks on today but let me go unpack my groceries and then we can proceed with I guess more sneaker things so I'm back from my little failed sneaker adventure because yeah like I said I was really hoping to get those dunks and then I also thought that the street hawker dunks might drop today um, but yeah, they didn't or there isn't much information because Fast Times did a post about it I think yesterday and then they just said like stay tuned and that was like all the updates and when I saw some people running to um, the direction where Fast Times is earlier today I thought that they may have dropped and then I went I didn't even go into the store like I just like went past and there wasn't a line so I just assumed that they didn't drop them because I feel so bad when I go to stores um, and ask for like any limited release sneakers because I don't know I feel like they probably get asked that all the time by like resellers and stuff and I just feel really bad and I had a chat with the guy that worked at Nike and he said the same thing like they've been having a lot of random releases and I asked him about the dunk highs and he said he didn't have like much information he's just like well it's kind of like shock drops all the time um, so yeah that's all I know and he was really nice about it so it's completely fine and 
I don't know guys, I don't know. So anyway, I ended up going to the supermarket, like I mentioned before, so I bought a bunch of like different things. I really like these by the way. Well, I haven't tried this flavor before, but I just really like these um, Harvest Snap Baked Pea Chip. <laughs> Baked Pea Crisps. And um, yeah, this is just like the original salted flavor and it was on sale, so I had to get it. But yeah, I'm planning on making myself a salad for dinner tonight because I've just been eating really bad for the last... <gasps> ah! Oh my god, I just spilled tea. Hold on, I need to wipe this up. Hold on, hold on. I just tipped over my cup of tea that I had on my table from earlier today. So, am I even in frame? Probably not. But yeah, guys. Before I came home, I actually like went and got some frozen yogurt because I was looking at all the ice creams in the freezer before and I was so tempted to buy it but then I feel like if I have it in my freezer at home, like I just want to eat ice cream every day. So I had to refrain myself from buying those ice creams even though they look great. But yeah, I ended up having like frozen yogurt which isn't that much healthier but i just was kind of craving something cold because yeah it wasn't too hot today but it was like warm ish plus i'm wearing like a jumper so yeah anyway also i showed you guys that i got this veggie jerky i don't know if it's good maybe i should try it let me see what is this even made of non-gmo soy protein It tastes pretty good, but it's just a little bit hard, but not bad, not bad. Okay. Anyway. Let me just finish, like, putting away my groceries, and then I'll do a sit-down, and I'll show you guys the post dunks again properly. And I think by next video, I should probably do a video, like, all about the dunks that I've picked up, like the SP dunks, not the like SB dunks, if that makes any sense. Um, but yeah, anyway, <laughs> I was just looking at my dunk box because it's still on my counter right now. But yeah, I bought some stuff to make some salad later tonight, so I don't think I'll show you guys because it's probably not that exciting. So let me put this away and then I'll show you guys the coast dunks again. Um, and then we will call it a day, guys. Today has been quite random. I was really hoping that I would come back and have some sneakers to show you guys besides those coast dunks, but um, apparently not. So <laughs> hopefully I'm a little bit more successful next time. Also, I bought some coffee beans and this is just from Sensory Lab. I don't really know that much about coffee, um, but this one says blackberry jam and Milo milk, which is sort of, I guess, the flavors that you get from this bean i don't really know it just sounded really good and i have like a coffee grind at the back so when i feel like it i usually have coffee in the morning anyway okay let's put this away i'll be back soon so i'm back at my usual sneaker review spot well i usually sit on my couch but then lately i've been enjoying sitting on the floor because i just feel like this looks really cute with my murakami little flower and my bed cushion and then also because you can't really see the mess behind me but that is besides the point so let me show you guys the coast dunks again and i also notice when i compare it right next to the kentucky colorway you'll notice that the white panels on this sneaker isn't actually white it's more so like an off-white color compared to a pure white which is on the kentucky colorway but i think overall the coast colorway is just super nice and in terms of sizing, I personally find that the dunks fit true to size. And that is what most of my friends have told me as well. Because I usually ask a few of my friends before I give you guys sizing advice. Because I know that sizing can be quite tricky. Obviously, it'll be better if you can try it on before you purchase a pair. But you guys know what it's like. Like, you don't really get a chance to try it on. You kind of just need to know. And yeah, I find that they're true to size. Having said that though, I have mine in a men's 6.5, which is half a size up from my true to size. So it is a little bit roomy because I prefer my sneakers to not be that snug. But if you're unsure, if you go true to size, you should be fine. And um, yeah, guys, that is 
pretty much the coast down because I think it is such a nice colorway. I love the hints of like yellow slash gold on the sneaker. So you can also see on the tips of the laces there is this gold yellow um, lace tips. And then like I showed you guys before on the tag on the tongue of the sneaker girl. Did I just stutter? <laughs> on the sneaker. And then of course... At the back of the sneaker, you get your Nike embroidery. And I feel like this is such a nice colorway, super wearable, and definitely one of my favorites from that upcoming... What do I call it? Like the lineup? Yeah. <laughs> the upcoming lineup of dunks that are coming out. I feel like this is definitely one of my favorites. So yeah, I cannot wait to see the rest of the dunks that we'll be releasing this year. As you guys know, I'm going to try my best to get most of them, but I don't know how successful I will be. But yeah, for now, I'm super happy that I got my coast dunks. Thank you so much to my follower on Instagram that sold this to me. I really, really appreciate you. And uh, yeah, guys, hopefully I managed to get the vast gray dunks that I meant to drop today. I don't know what's going on with that. So I'll try and be a little bit more alert <laughs> in terms of drops and stuff because I don't know where these people get the information from because I definitely do not have any information. Um, I think my game has been pretty weak these days. But yeah guys, that is pretty much it for today's vlog. I know it was a little bit random, but I hope you enjoyed it anyway. And yeah, I'm just gonna make myself some dinner, edit this vlog, and then hopefully have it up for you guys. And yeah, I think that is all for me today. And um, thank you so much for watching. And give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I will see you guys really, really soon. Bye. So I'm back because I just wanted to show you guys how cute this looks with the Murakami flower pin. So I got this from Restore a few months ago. And this is the perfect shade of blue. Like it is a perfect match. And I just feel like this would look so cute on feet. I'll try and link them down below. Hopefully they still have it on their site. But look at this. Anyway, that was completely random. I was actually looking for something else and then I saw this flower pin in the drawer and I was like, oh my god, I have to put it on the shoe to show you guys. And I actually have like another Murakami flower. Wait, one sec. So this Murakami flower I actually bought when I was in Japan maybe two years ago. And look at this. This is perfect for the Kentucky colorway. But yeah, anyway, look at this. Okay guys, I'm gonna go for real now. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!